Okay, to start with, uh, just tell us your name and where you're from. My name's Joe Ferrero. Uh, I'm from Audubon, Pennsylvania. I uh, blog under the name uh, Joe the Nerd. I'm on the Huffington Post and Joe the Nerd Ferrero under Huff Huffington Post and Joe the Nerd .blogspot.com. Okay. Um, and uh, it was very obvious you were standing up. No one else was. You were standing with your back to the stage. And can you tell us exactly what it was you were doing and why? I'm protesting Arlen Specter even being at this forum. Uh, I'm a Democrat and we're becoming a bunch of self-loathing Democrats. This is the man that brought us Clarence Thomas, Sam Alito, we got a Roberts Court there. This is the man that said, okay, let these guys on to the court. This brought us Gore v. Bush, and it brought us the, the decision two weeks ago that everyone's upset about. Even Specter himself complained about that court decision. But he's the guy who put the people on, on the court. This is absurd. I don't understand why any self-respecting Democrat would allow this man into any form that says, you will be our standard bearer. It, it defies logic. So instead of being one of those idiots who screamed and yelled last summer, I just decided, stand up, turn my back to the man as a sign of silent protest. I did this to Sandra Day O'Connor on the 4th of July a couple years ago when she spoke in Philly. I might be the only guy doing it. But I'm not going to be disgraceful. I'm not going to be loud and obnoxious. But I'm going to stand with my back to him because I have Obama's back. Th this whole thing where we get Arlen Specter, we don't even get a trade for anything. This, this is crazy. And especially since we have a decent candidate standing in the wings. Uh, Sestak is, is a, I, I have Sestak as my congressman. I wish he would be my congressman forever. but. He wants to go on to something bigger. The guy ran a carrier fleet. I think he can handle the Senate. So I, I really think the choices that we have here, sell out our self-respect as Democrats, or go, go with someone who's a real Democrat. Now, what would you say to folks who say that one, Senator Specter always was very moderate and on certain issues almost liberal, and that especially recently has, has voted very much in favor with the, with the Democrats? It does not matter. It does not matter. He has uh, made his bet. Uh, Gore v. Bush is a direct result of a 5-4 to four decision from the Supreme Court. Uh, the decision last week. These are things that are most damaging to our country. Our, the voters got it right in 2000. And he was part of the Republican system that overrode Anita Hill's testimony, that overrode common sense to allow that fifth vote to allow George Bush to destroy this country. Our election was stolen in 2000, and he was part of the thieves. Now, uh, obviously, when, when he was electing these judges, he, he didn't expect that vote whatsoever. And, and I, I don't know his personal opinion on that, but he was, the chairman of the, he was chairman of the Judiciary Committee that allowed Clarence Thomas to be seated on the Supreme Court. If you go back in time to it, uh, do some research on it. it it's it's incredible and it's mind-boggling that this man could be our standard bearer. Um, so the, the last question then would be, if there's one message you wanted people to take away from what you did tonight, what would that be? Stand up and not be obnoxious. Just stand up, turn your back to the guy. He's turned his back to the country by his decisions of allowing these type of judges onto the court. These activist conservative judges are now on the court for life. Where do we get payback for that? Where's our pound of flesh? Uh, we're told we can go to the polls to vote somebody out if we don't like them. We can't do that with the Supreme Court, but we can do it with senators who make bad decisions. And these, this is, uh, the, the Gore v. Bush is a decision that's up there with the Dred Scott decision in destroying the fabric of this country. Someone must stand responsible for it. And we have to, we have to be responsible. This is crazy. Thank you very much. Thank you very time. much. I nice appreciate it, William.